you can just smell like the boldness from here. That is a kick. I'll be dancing for hours with this little cup. <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. We are continuing our Vancouver food tour and guys, we have a special one for you guys. Now in Vancouver, there is such a diversity of food and cultures and today we are taking you to the one and only Moroccan restaurant, guys. This is called Moltaka Moroccan Restaurant. The reviews are amazing and when you step into this restaurant, you are entering a different world, guys. It's like you're entering into Morocco. It is beautiful, guys. So come with me for a Moroccan food tour. And guys, the food in Morocco is so good. It's like a mixture of like rice. You have uh, raisins and chicken and stews and it is so tasty. I am starving. We just finished our dance class, so we are gonna go on a full blow Moroccan food feast. Come with me to Moltaka Moroccan Restaurant. Let's go. Okay guys, we just sat down at Moltaka Moroccan restaurant. Look at the atmosphere in here and like the music, it's beautiful. It's like a theme of gold and red and then they even got like candles on the tables, beautiful music, they have, it's just like very authentic in here. I've never been here before but the only Moroccan restaurant guys. So they have a full menu. We are going to have some delicious things, I'm telling you guys. I think first though, we need a coffee. I feel like they have Turkish coffee here. They also have Moroccan tea. So yeah guys, I am so excited. Okay guys, our Turkish coffee has arrived and look at this beautiful platter of Turkish coffee. And did you guys notice the hat that I have on? <laughs> they have traditional stuff here, so it's so fun. Last time we did a Moroccan video, it was in Miami. And uh, yeah, you guys were like, oh, show us more Moroccan food. So we're gonna have some Turkish coffee. What is in here? Is this the sugar? Let's see. Oh yes, brown sugar. And check this out. Oh, it's heavy. Turkish coffee. All right. I've never seen anything so done up. And this is solid, it's heavy. Okay, let's pour a couple. See if I can get it there. Oh, it's not coming yet. Was I supposed to open it up? <laughs> Hold on, maybe I am. No. No? Okay. I just gotta pour a lot. Whoa. Woo! Okay, there's one. I think it's more for decoration than pouring. Let's do the next one. There we go. Yay! Okay guys, well I've poured Moroccan tea before. If you've seen my last video and I like pulled it all the way up to here and you gotta do it like three times, but I guess the coffee's different. <laughs> all right, let's do it. Let's try this. Ow, it's hard to get around. Pretty. So Turkish coffee, all of the grinds are at the bottom and it's super strong and that's why they give you a little mini cup because you'll be bouncing off the walls with just this. You can just smell like the boldness from here. Ooh, that is, that is a kick. I'll be dancing for hours with this little cup. <laughs> mm. All right guys, so amazing Turkish coffee. And at this restaurant, they give you a side of olives. So look at that. I believe there's, different colors of olives. This one is black, there's like green olives. Um, let's see, they look fresh, they're still on the stick. <laughs> it 
So is there a nut in this? I don't eat olives often. Hold on. There is a nut. Mmm. Salty. I'm not a crazy olive person, but if you like olives, they taste really fresh. It's like a sour bitterness, but um, I guess it goes like as an appetizer. Well, Moroccan food is known for having like a lot of freshness and raisins and cashews, and that's what makes it so sweet. And their um, their tagines are like fantastic, guys. So I cannot wait to show you the food. It is going to be amazing. Okay guys, we just placed our order. We have two amazing authentic appetizers coming up. We're getting three homemade lean lamb meges, which is halal homemade sausages, braised in harissa sauce, served with salad, and it's mildly spicy. I love spicy, so that's good. And then we got the traditional chicken pastilla, which is like a chicken pastry. It is so good, guys. And the waitress was saying that there's our amazing traditional Moroccan pastry filled with chicken and almonds, sweet and savory. It pairs well with tokaji. Don't know what that is. Um, and then we got something that's gonna come on fire. Alfonso, are you excited to see something come on fire? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we're getting a flambe duck with cherry sauce. So the waitress was saying this is gonna look beautiful. It's gonna come on fire. It is um, duck breast with Moroccan spices, cherry sauce, and um, table side flambe. I cannot wait, guys. This Turkish coffee is just perfect for a cold, rainy day here in Vancouver. Okay guys, we're trying the lamb meges. This looks beautiful. I love the plating here. They really care about how their dishes are coming out. Beautiful lamb. It looks like it's topped with some healthy bean sprouts. Yeah. Okay, let's try it. I'm so hungry after three hours of dancing. Ooh, looks spicy. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Mm. Oh my gosh, you gotta eat it slow. It is juicy, it has so much flavor. I love it, it's good. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. They even came with a side of bread, guys. Beautiful bread. Nice and hot and fluffy. How's the bread, Alfonso? Is it good? Oh yes it is. Yes it is. <laughs> Let's try the salad on the side. Beautiful salad. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Fresh. Guys, I feel like if you take the bread, I don't even know if this is appropriate, but I feel like if you take the bread and mix it, it's gonna be really good. It's like a, it's like a pita now. Put the lamb. And it's a little bit spicy, this lamb. And there you go. Mmm. Oh, the bread is really good. Super soft. Homemade. Mmm. I love it, guys. Okay, our next dish is another starter. The chicken pastilla. It is amazing. Super authentic Moroccan food. Okay, guys, the Turkish coffee's kicking in. This music is good. Take a look at the next dish. This is the chicken pastilla. So it is chicken-filled pastry, guys, but it looks like it's even topped with some sugar and cinnamon, almonds, and mint. This is why I love Moroccan food. They sweeten it with like raisins, like natural things, like prunes. It's not like processed sugars and, you know? So I absolutely love it. We're gonna cut it in half. Move a little, ooh, it's crispy. Very crispy. Let's see if I can get a nice view for you guys. There it is. Chicken inside of a pastry with sweet. You would like think maybe that wouldn't go like chicken and sugar or cinnamon, but Moroccans have their own ways of making it work, guys. Okay, let's try it. Looks hot. Oops. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, that's so good. The flavors are incredible. 
It's like sweet and savory at the same time. And the chicken is fall apart delicious. Oh my gosh. And there's a little bit of a crispiness on the outside of the pastry. Look guys. Mm. There's even some raisins too in there. It is making it so perfect. I don't know if you traditionally just use it with a fork and knife, but just eating it like this is so good. Mmm. Oh my god. Mm -mm -mm. I love it. Okay, guys. That is the two appetizers. The entree is gonna come on fire. I cannot wait to show you guys. Okay guys, so here is the famous tagine, guys. This is a lamb shoulder and it is so like authentic for Moroccan. This, they cook always in a tagine. Look at the inside. Whoa, that looks so good. Oh my gosh, guys, like I was saying that they put, they cook with their prunes and the almonds and raisins and that's what gives it that sweetness. Look how soft and juicy that looks. Guys, I cannot wait to get into the food. Oh, wow. Don't touch it, I'm just kidding. That looks insane. <laughs> right go away, it, don't go, touch go it. For it, go for it. <laughs> Look at this dish. Oh my gosh, guys. No wonder why it was a little bit. This is the, what is this? Couscous with maraguez. Lamb. Yes. With lamb, merges, couscous sauce, and caramelized onions. Whoa, couscous sauce and caramelized onions, guys. This looks insane. This is what I'm talking about, guys. Food that soothes your soul. Benny, you're going to have an amazing meal right now. Thank you so much. <laughs> I cannot wait to show you guys this flaming duck that's going to come on fire. Cannot wait. Food is delicious. Wow, look at that, guys. It's on fire already. Ooh, wow. wow! Oh my god. That's nice! Cool! We chose off a restaurant in here. <laughs> wow, looks good. Beautiful! Look at that juicy piece of meat, wow. guys. Wow, that's perfect. It's dripping. It is food. <laughs> Thank you so much. No problem. Do you like Moroccan food? I do love it. I do love it. Yeah. I mean, that's super different from the food. Yeah. From my country. Uh huh. Because they use a lot of spices in it, right? Yeah. But this is so, so fascinating. Of yeah, course. I love it. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, we saw that on fire. What a show. Look at that. Juicy, juicy meat, guys. Moroccan food is just amazing. It's like one of the best in the world, guys. Um, it's crazy good. It looks like we got a side of potatoes, vegetables. Um, again, there's like prunes here, beautiful salads. Okay, well, let's not wait. Let's get into this juicy meat, guys. He showed it to us. Look at that. Ooh, I think it's cooked to perfection too. Like Gordon Ramsay would say, a little bit pink on the inside. It's perfect. Okay, let's get crispy skin. Ooh, that cut really easy. All right, I haven't tried Moroccan duck before. Mmm, oh my gosh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, it's like perfect. It's sweet and salty and it's juicy. Oh my gosh, look at the juice on this piece of meat, guys. Crispiness on the outside. There's some sweetness coming off here. I don't know if it's because it's these black pieces. I feel like they are prunes. Oh my gosh, that is good. I should have put a piece of meat too at the same time. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I love it. I love it. Sweet, savory, salty. These pieces of fruit too add so much flavor. So we had this darker one, but this one, I'm not sure what it is. Oh, 
don't know what that is. It's kind of a fruit. I want to say plum, but there's no way that's a plum. I'm not sure, apricot maybe? Maybe apricot, I think I got it. This is a prune, this is an apricot. Um, let's try the potatoes. Super soft. Mmm, there's some sort of a spice here. It tastes like, um, it tastes like the breakfast one. Zatar? Zatar, yeah. Yeah, it tastes like zatar on this side. The meat is so good though. Like the mixture, when you take the duck and then you add an apricot on top, so good. Mmm, I love it. Crazy good food, guys. We have a lot of food to eat here. We're gonna sit here, we're gonna enjoy. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Guys, we had delicious Moroccan food at this restaurant. Vancouver is such a diverse place, guys. You gotta check this place out. Like this video, subscribe.